So in that category of, of age leads, as you take the data file in, um, one of the things that we like to do uh, is just very uh, quickly, um, almost as quickly as you would in real time, um, get into contact uh, with that individual and, and make them a part of your pipeline. Um, and so sort of the, the techniques that are available to you uh, that, that tend to be very effective uh, is simply kind of a three-step system and trying to make those three touches right off the bat. And so oftentimes we'll do uh, something like um, uh, a, a, um, an email uh, or a text message or a voicemail, uh, sort of the order in which you do those. Um, can kind of depend. Uh, often we suggest that you actually um, reach out to them uh, via phone call uh, and then you always leave a voicemail. So that can be a drop uh, of a voicemail is usually the most efficient because most of these people won't pick up um, and you're simply leaving something like, uh, and then, again, this should be in your age lead file. Hey, you know, a couple months ago, uh, you requested a rate quote online. We weren't able to connect. Um, I'd love to, to, to reach out to you if you haven't gotten your auto insurance yet, or if you have any questions about auto insurance, or, hey, you should consider us for a six month review or something like that. Um, immediately after that, um, uh, hopefully again, this starts to kind of kick in your automation, uh, is to follow up with an email. Uh, sometimes even on the voicemail, I'll tell them, hey, I'm gonna send you an email with all my contact information. That makes that email sort of open uh, and deliver better because they, they've kind of heard you or they've seen you on your phone. And then the text message right. um, is super effective. The response rate to text messages um, are so much higher. And, and again, the simple, hey, I'm just checking in on you is the best text message you can send.